I didn't want to make another election video, but now that the election's over, it's showing a lot of true colors from people. This country is so divided. When I went on my phone, I saw so much hate, so much discrimination against who people voted for. Like that's gonna change anything. Like hate or pessimism is gonna change anything. What does this country become? Where's the hope? Where's the faith? Where's the belief in the country? Where's the belief in it? There's no trust. Also, why are people crying? Why, why are people so invested that they're crying? You know you're being manipulated, right? You are completely manipulated by the media. You don't even have your own individual thought. You're so scared that you don't even have hope for your own future. You really think these people control your complete future. We're divided. We're divided and we're, we're honestly confused. We're confused. The only hope for the future is Gen Z. That's my opinion. I'm not saying that's a fact. I'm saying that's my opinion. I believe Gen Z is our way out. Gen Z knows how to be real. We know how to be unified. We can relate with one another. This diversification of beliefs and who, like, it's not just a division with men and women. It is a division of complete beliefs. That America is a free country. Why are we so, that doesn't make any sense. America is the freest country. We are the country that unifies. We are like, what's the problem? What, why are we so fearful? That's the real issue. We're so scared and we're letting this fear fuel our decision making, letting us be more impulsive. That's not okay. And what I saw this morning was so upsetting. It was so disappointing. Like this country is so, it's sad. And that's why I'm making this video today because I want to remind Gen Z that it's up to us. It's up to us to make a difference. It's up to us to make unison. The, everyone is going to have an, a, a disagreement, but it's up to Gen Z to bring the light of unification to others. Bring the light of, hey, it doesn't matter who you vote for. It doesn't matter what you believe in. We're in America. We all want pretty much the same happiness and the same positivity, the same optimism. We all want hope and faith. We all want some good, right? We can all agree that we all want good in this world. Yes or no? Yes. So that's what, that's what Gen Z brings. Gen Z brings this level of mutual understanding between all the generations, between all the sexes, between every person. Gen Z brings a level of mutual understanding. It's up to us. So now that the election's over, now that this, all this hype is over, can we accept it? Can we please accept it and not go blaming others, finding, finding reasons, finding like being a victim to a situation that you are manipulated in. You, you, <laughs> it's just an election. There are two people. They are two human beings. We don't need to discriminate. We don't need to talk ish about anybody, okay? And just to be frank, just to be clear, Trump was president before, so we don't need to discriminate against someone who was actually a president. That's un-American. So, thank you. That's it. Um, I really want to bring more light into the world. We need to bring more unification. So, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much, and I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>